Rescue me, rescue me, rescue me. It is that time again, and we're down here with it. We're just chock full of dogs this week. Unbelievable. We have a great variety, though. Yes, we mm -hmm. do. We have a lots of different kinds of dogs, lots of personalities, younger ones, older ones, middle-aged ones, and little cutie patooties like the one you've got there. I just love this dog, Debra. He's overlooked. He's he is very overlooked, but how can it be overlooked? Look at his markings. He's a tricolor. He's got a great face. He's peppy when you meet him. What's the deal? He looks sad. I think he Aww. looks really sad in his kennel. I honestly think it makes him look older than he is. Taz is only about three. But he, he looks so sad down he here does. that he looks older. But get him outside of here, out on the grass, out on the lawn. He's a happy, young, fabulous, sweet dog. We need a special person to put a smile on this dog's face. And anybody out there, I'm betting it's going to be you. So why don't you come down and meet Mr. Taz? We love Taz. His ID number is 181-448. You are going to love him. If that's not about the cutest thing you've ever seen, it, well, it is. This is um, one of our foster dogs. He is out in foster because he did not like the shelter, and he had some problems um, with a cracked jaw and some bad teeth, but that has all been taken care of, and he um, will likely, he, his dental issues are basically over, but he probably will need annual dental cleanings. He's about six years old. He is so sweet, house trained, very smart, knows basic commands, and loves to take walks, is easy and mellow in the home. Why wow, is this dog not that's adopted? that's quite a resume. So if you would like to meet this dog, he is in foster, call our office at 781-4400. If you have any problems getting through, then you can call Animal Shelter Adoption Partners at 489-0689, and they will contact the foster mom who will contact you. I would love to take the call and tell you everything you want to know about Remy. He is a doll. ID number 178-777. This is Remy. This pretty girl's name is Daisy May. She loves to play with other dogs. She's got a lot of energy. She's really fun and she's really affectionate. I'm really fond of this dog. Um, her ID number is 181-942, about four years old, the perfect age to be a wonderful companion. Deborah, this is some handsome dog. This is a Chesapeake Bay Retriever. You don't see them very often wow. in our area. He is gorgeous. He's a neutered male. Chester is very fun. He loves people. He loves walks. He's good on the leash, too, which is nice in such a large dog. Chester's ID number is 181-961. Oh, this is a beautiful girl. I'm not sure what she is. She's some kind of hound dog. She's absolutely gorgeous. Um, Tori is about three years old. She's terrific to walk on the leash, very easy to walk on the leash. She likes some dogs and not so, not so much with others, so she needs to be carefully placed in home with other dogs or be an only dog probably, but she is stunning and sweet. ID number 182141. This is Tori. Oh, this is Eli. Isn't he the cutest thing? He is. He looks like a puppy, but he's apparently about a year old, so he's not going to grow much more. This is this is what there is. So he this is, guy's going to be cute forever. He's going to be f cute forever. He'll he's have your friends ooing and eyeing if you take Eli as your very own. He will be forever your teeny tiny. Mm -mm. Eli's ID number is 182388. Take a good look at Ebony, who looks so beautiful with her yellow... Um, scarf on she is a good girl she's overlooked she's a black dog she nobody will pay attention to her and she is so loving and so sweet she's she seems to be very house trained she's easy to walk on the leash and she is happy all of the time she is a shelter favorite ebony's id number is 181110 not is so a fast not so fast oh, there's more half her adoption fee is paid ah. yes we like her so much that we put it together to have half her adoption fee paid. We want her out of here quickly. So not only do you get the greatest dog, you get half your adoption fee paid for you. Wonderful, wonderful dog. Come on down and consider Ebony. You'll love her. ID 181110. All I can say, folks, is we have got to get this dog out of here. She does not like it here. She is such a sweet girl. She looks miserable in her kennel. She just implores you to get me out of here. She's such a smart dog, Deborah. I think that's why. A lot of dogs... She's also pretty good on the leash, and she has such a loving personality. ...along here, but a dog like Sadie, she knows what's going on, and she is frightened almost all the time. She but what really a wonderful girl she is. She is. She is terrific, and she really deserves to get into a home where she's comfortable and happy. She does... She, you know, she is particularly good with little dogs. Sadie, we put her out in just crowds of little dogs, and she's just happy as she can be. She's just so, so sweet. And, and that's why we've made her a volunteer's pick. All the volunteers feel so strongly about her. 
and are so motivated that she gets out of here and gets the best of home that they have given her the title of Volunteer Pick of the Month of February. That means half her adoption fee has been waived. So she's got it all going for her. She just needs to get going. She does. And to do that, she needs one of you out there to just say to yourself, you know what? This dog appeals to me. I understand her situation, and I'm going down there and meeting her. You look into those pretty brown eyes, you will not be able to leave without her. I promise you. Sadie's ID number, 172-983-Volunteer Pick of the Month. Somebody please come down here and save Camilla. She's being called size 22 stubby pants by Greer, and that's, that's no way for a beautiful girl to be treated. So please, come get this fun, dog-loving, happy, life-loving, crazy, beautiful girly out of here. Camilla's ID number is 179282. Once again, to buy those stubby pants, we've paid half her adoption fee. Wow, so wow. 50 bucks $50 off. $50 off. Imagine how many pants you can buy with that. She, you, and all the love that she has to give, I can't see how you can resist. She is irresistible. She really is. She's, she's short in stature, big on personality. 179282, Camilla. You know, Deborah, I know you're going to say something about these ears. He has spectacular ears, Andy does. Those are, those, those are A++ ears. He's a super nice little guy. He is loving. He just wants to be in your lap. He does well with other dogs. He's just all kinds of fun, and he is so cute. How old is he? About five. Ah, he looks a lot younger than five. He looks very young. He's at that age, though, where his behavior is practically perfect. This is great because this is the age where they're just about perfect and they just are starting to get going in life. They have a very long life, those little guys. They don't do all that dumb puppy stuff. Yeah. You know, can't mm -hmm. stand that dumb puppy stuff. And he's mature and sophisticated. His ID number is 182358. This is Mac, the big man. He's <laughs> also ticklish, apparently. <laughs> Mac is... He loves a lot of it the other dogs down Sandy's here. It seems that Sandy's got his spot. <laughs> Once you get a dog spot, whoa, they love it. And he there's his spot. You can see it. <laughs> He's loving that. He's a funny, fun-loving guy. He's in lots of play groups down here. He does well with most other dogs. Does not like cats, so no cats for this one. Very good on the leash, too, which you wouldn't think of to look at him. ID number 181157. Wait Mac. a minute. Oh, Max got half his no adoption way. fee paid. Yes. I, yes, yes, yes. He does. Half adoption fee paid. We want him out of here. We want him into a loving, happy, playful home so they can have the advantage of all that tag, oh, I tail think wagging. I, he spotted himself in the camera for a mm -mm. second there. Okay, so half off Mac 181157. This is Greer's pet dog right here. This is Pearly. She is fabulous. She has a wonderful personality. She holds her own down here with the big old boy dogs, and she never gets mad, and she never gets upset. She is just as sweet as she can be. We love Pearly down here. How old is she? Pearl is just maybe a year and a half old. Wow. She's ID number 181732, beautiful, beautiful Pearl. I think that Rudy is in the running for the best looking dog in the shelter. He is as beautiful as beautiful gets. His owners could no longer keep him, um, but he was raised with young children and did very well with them. He does not like cats, <laughs> but he likes most other dogs. And he's just absolutely gorgeous and fun and playful and young. Rudy's ID number is 181714. As you say, Terry, this is a dog that will get you noticed. Uh-huh. And not. that tail is wagging at all times. He's, he's if you want a ball dog, you want Finley. He'd probably also be really great at agility. This is a great little dog. Um, man, he loves to fetch. He's also very house trained, very active and happy, and about maybe a year and a half at the most. It's hard so to get him to keep still, I might it, add. It is. He, does, he is an energetic little guy. His ID number is 180957. His name is Finley. And oh. he's got half off his adoption he fee. He does. I'm yes, sitting here he looking at it right there. I tell you, our dogs Isn't are that great? down here. Come down here and adopt these dogs. Wonderful they're, they're, dog. They're Meet Finley. They're more than worth it at full price, but at half price, heck. Take two. Okay, I have to tell you, i got to be honest, this is my favorite dog in the entire shelter. I'm crazy about this dog. This is Jeter. And I love him so much because he loves everybody so much. He loves every other dog so much. He is so tolerant. Other dogs can even get snarky and kind of mean and growl and snap at him, and he doesn't care. He doesn't do anything. He rolls over on his belly and says, hey, I'll be your best friend. Mm -hmm. In the right hands, this is a therapy dog. This is an ambassador for, for breed. This is everything great you can think of. I love Jeter. And when you get a dog that you love, you really love this I dog. I really love him, and he even seems to be okay with cats. 
he can he was a bit of an escape artist so he needs to be in a secure yard if he was with me though he'd be on, he'd be by the on the couch with me sleeping with me he wouldn't have a chance to get out I wow i would not let this dog out of my sight so you give him, him really high marks a plus 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 a plus plus listen to that folks deborah knows dog one eight zero two four four jeter the very best this is Blaze, and if you take a look at that face, you can see a dog who is insulted and horrified to be down here at the shelter. He just cannot believe he is here. He is easygoing. He has, uh, one of our volunteers has taught him sit, down, come, stay, leave it, paw, roll over, watch, and stand. He's wow. picking all of those up. Some of them he has down cold. He's learning the others. He loves tug of war. He loves to play in the water. Um, he doesn't like cats or livestock, so, you know, none of that. And he loves female dogs. He is such a wonderful companion, beautiful brown coat, great ears, all-around good dog. His name is Blaze, shelter favorite, 176979. Tango's in the running, I think, for the other best-looking dog in the shelter. He is gorgeous, just about two years old, young, happy, nice guy. We have him in play groups down here. He's pretty good with other dogs. He's affectionate, and he can calm down nicely, too, which is always nice. ID number 181937. This is Tango. See, he's going to let himself be beat up by Larry and everything. We need to find some loving and sympathetic people to come adopt Toby. He's about eight years old. He's got a little bit of older dog issues. That's why he's here. He loves people. He loves to be petted. He gets along kind of okay with other dogs, but probably would be best as the only dog in the home. Um, but just, just a loving older dog who needs a retirement home. So if you can do that, please come meet him. This is the ID thing that gets me most is to have the older dog down here. They just do not do well at the shelter. This is not fun and games for them at all. No, it's not fun and games for them. They don't like it. They don't understand it. They're it's more true. difficult to adopt. Yes, yes, yes. And we all get really, really sad when we have an older dog down here. And so that's why we like to offer the senior rebate on such a dog, Deborah. We have $35 to rebate you back on the adoption fee of Toby if you decide to adopt him. Well, that's a nice deal. So you, so you save some money and you get a nice companion. Yes, yes, yes. ID number 39597, Toby. This is Toby. He is about, oh, maybe a year and a half old. Um, he's young. He's still very much a puppy. He's probably our longest residing dog at this point, which is not a good position to be in down here. And I think the reason it's taking so long to adopt him out is he is very high energy. Toby has tons of energy. I but was he's just, a young dog. He I mean, is that's very the... young. And the thing is, he's really smart and he's really trainable. I think he's wicked smart. Somebody could, could just really take this dog and train him to do just about anything. And how about Toby as a running partner? Would Absolutely. Would he be a jogging companion? I had him out this morning. I was throwing the ball for him. Um, he, I, what went through my mind was this guy needs to be owned by someone who rides a bike, ah. by someone who jogs, because he's just got so much energy, but he's also got that sweet, affectionate side that comes out more when he's a little tired. Yes, yes, yes. So, so you put a dog in the right position, he thrives. Something like that for Toby would be excellent. He's good with other dogs as long as the other dog can put up with a very hard player. He's a hard player. Um, he's a great, there is a fabulous companion here. There's just, I think, a brilliant dog in here. But he needs the right home, a very active one. And guess what I'm going to say? Half his adoption fee has been put up because we love this dog so much. We want this dog out of here. So half the adoption fee has been paid on him. Nothing makes us happier than to see the old dogs go and the longest residing dog leave the building. That's what we want for Toby. ID number 180435. And yet another favorite with us down here, this is Hobbs. And he is so gentle. He is so sweet. He's terrific with other dogs. Um, I think he'd be great for the kids. He's just so easygoing and so well So if you mannered. needed another dog to be a companion to your dog, he'd be perfect for that? Absolutely. Mm. Absolutely. I can't think of a situation I think he wouldn't be good in because he's just so easygoing and nice. Um, his ID number is 182249 Hobbs. The 4th of February was a big day for dogs coming in. This is another newcomer to the shelter. Uh, we think he's about three years old, little boy, from um, Pepper Tree Road in the North County. Uh, his ID number is 182471. We sure wish he had an ID, just like all of these dogs that are coming in. Most of them have no ID on them at all. Sometimes they have collars, nothing's written on them, they don't have tags, they don't have licenses, they don't have microchips. Any of those things would get these dogs home. 
So please, everybody, if you love them, tag them, ID them, write their, their, your phone number on their collar. They're wonderful little beings. They deserve to go home. ID number 182471 on this sweet little guy. So what you see here is a loving pair, Judy and her foster Curly. This dog is just terrific. He loves to sit on your lap. He loves to lie in the sunshine. Other dogs loves them. He never met anyone that he didn't like. He loves to sleep under the covers. Isn't that adorable? But will also sleep in a crate as an option if you need him to do that. As a walking companion, Curly always has his paw raised. Yes, I'd love to go on a walk. He's house trained, has good manners, doesn't bark. And he has been tested and fostered with cats and small children and has greeted everyone he has met with the idea that this is my next best friend. So if you want to get in touch with Judy to meet Curly, why don't you give us a call at 489-0689, that's Animal Shelter Adoption Partners, and we'll connect you with Judy. Okay, that's Curly. His ID number is 179222. So look at that handsome guy. Look at the ears on him. He is he is really, really handsome. His name is Rambo and um, he is young, between one and two years old probably. He's just what can I tell you? He's young, he's happy, he's energetic, he's full of himself. He's just a funny, handsome guy. ID number 182277. This is Rambo. Deborah, here's another volunteer favorite. I haven't heard uh, more buzz about a dog than this dog in a very long while. Pepper is very beloved. More affectionate, more loving. You're just not going to find. She's gentle. She's quiet. She's just so sweet. If she could just curl up in your lap and go to sleep and stay there, she would be perfectly happy. I think she saw herself there. I just can't say enough about this dog's sweetness. She is quite remarkable. Her name is Pepper. She wants her people. She came in with another dog, so she seems to do fine with other dogs. And we want to get her out of here because she doesn't like it. And One she's bit. beautiful. She's gorgeous. Beautiful. Mm -mm -mm. Her ID number is 175396. Come down and meet her. You, you will just love her so much you won't believe it. Bear has those great ears, too. Look at that. I love a dog with good ears. He's, he's another one down here who's really depressed in his kennel. He just does not like it here. It makes him so very sad. Um, he needs, I think, a quiet home with p attentive people. He's so loving. He does well with other dogs. Um, he's, he's happy when he's outside of his kennel. Oh, there he is. And you see his tail wagging back there. He's he happy can do right it. Now. We know he can, he can do, do it. it. So his family's out there for him somewhere. I just know it. Maybe it's your family. I hope so. Bear's ID number is 172 Five nine five. He's very loved down here. Very loved. This is Chuck. He's pretty cute, Terry. He's very cute. In fact, uh, he reminds me of the dog that was featured on the Super Bowl, one of the commercials of the Budweiser beer, Bud Light, as that we go that served up some beers to people. I wonder if this dog could learn to do that. Here we go. Uh, here we go. <laughs> he but looks pretty good. His name. His name is Chuck. His name's Chuck. His name is Chuck. But I'm sure he'd bring you your beer if that's what you wanted him to do or, you know, whatever else, uh, whatever other libation you're interested in. He's got a nice, fuzzy, furry little face, which I think is hilarious. Yes, so, it is hilarious. Cute and small and hilarious. That is Chuck. Come check him out. ID number 182302. This is, yes, Fluffy. Yes, that is his name. And that's an adorable is, name. He's hilarious also. He is a good guy. He's happy all the time. He's goofy. He's good with girl dogs, not always with boys, but he likes the girls. And um, we just like him. You know, he's a salami head. He's just a big old galoof. What, what do you want in a dog? You want Fluffy. He's got a great heart. He's got a huge heart. Nice bandana, too. Looking pretty good. Looking handsome. Fluffy is 181488. He's a really good dog. Now, Myra's going to have a tough time. She, she came here because she apparently escaped from her yard. And it's going to be a little tough for her to get adopted because somebody's chopped her ears off. And that does not help them. But she's a nice, very enthusiastic dog. Myra is happy. She's loving. She's a good girl. Um, she's had a, some puppies, but she doesn't have to do that anymore. She doesn't have to be a mom anymore. She just gets to be someone's, someone's friend. Myra's ID number is 171292. Well, Deborah, here's a nice medium-sized gal. You know what? She's, she's still a little bit of a baby, though. We think she's only eight or nine months old, so ah. she may have a little bit of growing to do. She's pretty. She's got that beautiful pale brown coat. A fawn. We call that fawn. Just a little baby named Daisy. Oh, she saw herself. ID number 182212. 
I can't believe nobody's looking for these two dogs. They were found running together in the South County off of Teft and Oakland. I just, they're so sweet. I don't know why someone isn't looking for their two babies. On the left is Biscuit. He's ID number 181798. On the right is Crockett, ID number 181796. They are absolutely sweet, adorable little dogs. Come adopt them one or as a pair, and you will be so happy you have them. Anybody would. Look at them. Again, ID numbers 181796 for Crocker, 181798 for Biscuit. This beauty's name is Diesel, and his owners could no longer keep him. They had a living situation that wouldn't allow that. So unfortunately, he's ended up down here at the shelter, and he needs a new home. So if you want a big, beautiful blue dog to walk around with, here he is. Diesel's ID number is 164969. This is Katie, and again, if you want a ball dog, she is it. She runs, she gets that ball, she brings it back, she sets it down in front of you, and then she sits and waits for you to throw it again. It's really quite great to watch. Katie's a good girl, about three years old, ID number 181818. This is a relative newcomer to the shelter. She was picked up um, in Aurora Grande on, on Fair Oaks um, on the 30th of January. So are you missing your little dog? She's down here. She's so sweet. She's immediately in your lap, as, as Judy was saying, exactly what a chihuahua is supposed to do. So if you want a perfect little sweet little girl about three years old, come check out a girl we're going to start calling Jenny. Her ID number is 182389. Another relative newcomer to the shelter. Um, he came in on January 30th. He was picked up in the South County, Madero, and El Campo in rural Aurora Grande. Are you missing your chocolate Labrador? We have one down here, so he might be yours. He's a nice dog, extreme high energy, but a very nice dog. ID number 182387. Well, if he looks a little anxious, it's because he too is a newcomer to the shelter. He Ooh. came in on the 4th of February from Paso Robles, found uh, on 1600 Via Rosa. And he doesn't want to be here. He wants to go home. So if you are missing your little guy, we've got him down here. His ID number is 182478. If he isn't redeemed, he will be up for adoption soon. Well, this little guy is just about two months old, and we want you to come um, adopt him because when puppy's in the house, nobody looks at anybody else. So please come take a look at this little male. He's, again, two months old. We haven't even named him yet. He's going to have to get a name. But his ID number is 182177. For now, we'll just call him cute little puppy. Here's another newcomer to the shelter. We found this dog in San Luis on Johnson and Old General Hospital area. Are you missing this chihuahua? He's male. We think he's about two years old and his ID number is 182429. We found him on the 2nd of February. He's somebody's. Take a look. ID number 182429. If we don't get him reclaimed, you can adopt him. 182429. This is Nikki. He's here with his foster, um, Sandy, who's been taking care of him. He's a great little dog. She loves him to death. He's improved so much in her care. He used to be very skittish with people. It's improved greatly. Um, he's very social now with, with people. He likes to walk on the beach, plays with other dogs. He's very quiet. He never barks, but he'll, he will howl when trucks go by. Now, everybody wants a dog that does that. He likes ear massages and snuggling in bed. He likes his crate. He does well on a leash. He is an all-around good dog who does well with her chickens as well. So if you are interested in this sweet little guy, please give the office down here a call at 781-4400. And if you have any problems getting through, call Animal, Adoption Shelter, or Animal Shelter Adoption Partners at 489-0689. Nikki's ID number is 175428. This little fuzzball name is Baxter. He's just your all-around cute little terrier mix of some sort. Um, he's, he's, you know, small won't eat much. What more could you want? Look at that face. And he's cute. And he's cute. Look at that face. ID number 180989 Baxter. Some of our fosters do double duty and that's exactly what's going on with Sandy. She has another little little dog um, that she's taking care of. This is Lucy. ID number 178177 and Sandy says she has been so much fun to foster. She took her in to foster because she was so frightened, especially of men, and now she's not. She loves people. She likes to play tug-of-war. She loves the beach. Um, if you would like to find out more about Sweet Little Lucy, you can call the office down here at 781-4400. If you have any problems getting through, call Animal Ad Shelter Adoption Partners at 489-0689. Lucy needs to get into a home because then we'll have Sandy to foster someone else.
Doesn't somebody recognize these dogs? They were picked up together in San Luis Obispo on the 28th of January. They are as cute as they can be. They're little girls, very loving, um, just adorable. On the left-hand side, you have um, ID number 182365. On the left is ID number 182366. Both little girls, as sweet as they can be. Somebody should be looking for these two. Okay, now let's get to our cats. We're starting out with Zoe. Zoe is a gorgeous black cat, and she's a great representative for our black cat rebate. Yes, we will rebate you $25 if you adopt one of our black cats here. Zoe is gorgeous. She's just about five years old. Her fur is just like velvet, as you can see. Gorgeous green eyes, and her ID number, if you want to connect with her, 182363. That's Zoe. 182363. Hello, Bucky. She is a tabby on white with those gorgeous green eyes. Can you see those eyes? Ooh, gorgeous. She is ID number 181907, and Bucky qualifies for the senior rebate. Yes, we like to get our seniors out of here quickly. So if you adopt Bucky, you get $35 back on her adoption fee. 181907. Here's a fluffy gal. She is Madison Lee. Her ID number, 181950, Madison Lee. Say hi to Alex. He is another one of our black cats. He's just three years old, and he qualifies for the black cat rebate. Why? Because he's black. That's right. $25 back on the adoption fee. He is ID number, 182169. Whoa, next up we've got Duffy. He is a tall, tall cat. ID number 182245. Duffy, take a look at this gorgeous calico, long-haired. ID number 182436. Her name is Miranda. 182436. She is gorgeous. Hey, Fernando. Here we have a orange tabby on white. That's an unusual combination. Fernando is male, ID number 182474. Fernando. You black and white fans, here's Michael. He is just about two years old and his ID number 182473, Michael. Here's a cutie pie black and white tuxedo. Mang is only nine months old. ID number 182451, Mang. Here's a newcomer to the shelter. We found this cat on the 1st of February in a Tascadero on Viejo Camino and the Camino Real. This cat is male, ID number 182420. Are you missing him? 182420. Say hi to Melissa. She is a gorgeous calico, just about a year old. Her ID number 182390. Melissa. Say hi to Barley. Barley is just about two years old. ID number 182421. Barley. Here's a handsome long-haired cat. This cat is male, and we're calling him Cafe. His ID number, 181897, Cafe. You fans of all white cats, here's Gogo. Gogo is female. She's just about four years old. ID number, 182016, Gogo. Here's a very sweet cat. This is Tess. Tess is a gorgeous tabby. ID number, 182283, Tess. Yes, we've still got some kittens. And you know what? We're getting into kitten season now in another month. And we have these kittens left over. These are 2011 models, if you will. We need to get them out of here. Nonetheless, we have uh, the all black one, 182440. And the black and white, 182442. Both of them are about three months old. Here is a very friendly cat. This is Simon. He's all white. And he was found in Paso Robles. He's wearing a collar, kind of pinkish, with a bell on it. Do you recognize him? His ID number, 182391. 